Hey, this is Ryan from webeminence.com, and I'm going to explain one of the core and often overlooked principles of pay-per-click marketing, and that's the difference between the display network and the search network. And to put it very simply in one sentence, the display network shows ads to people browsing websites, and the search network shows ads on search engines when people search for specific keywords. So I'm going to first show you the search network, and this is what most people think of when they think of pay-per-click marketing. So if I were to search for Chicago Bears tickets in Google, I would see the organic results here and a number of ads. And you can tell these are ads because they have the little ad icon by them. And these are advertisers who are actually bidding to be shown in these advertising spots, and they pay when their ad gets clicked. And since they're advertising on the search network, they know that their ad is going to show when someone is actively searching for Chicago Bears tickets. So when someone is actively searching for something, it's usually more likely that they're ready to buy. So advertising in the search network generally leads to more conversions than the display network, which I'll show you next. So this site is a good example of a site using the Google display network. So the advertisers on this page are paying to be shown on this publishing website. And there's a few important things to mention about the display network. First of all, when you're an advertiser in the display network, you can use different methods to target your ads. This is a pro football statistics site, and they're showing a truck ad, which may be relevant, and then a tiny prints uh, print company ad. So there's several ways these ads are targeted. Sometimes it's the content on the page that's matched. Sometimes it's the demographic of the person visiting the site based on Google's data. Or sometimes they use remarketing, which means if you visit a page, like maybe you visit tinyprints.com and then come to this page, Tiny Prints may be using remarketing campaigns, which show ads to people who've previously visited their site. Obviously, if I'm on this site and just looking at football statistics, I'm not actively searching for a truck or for Tiny Prints. So the conversion rates overall for this type of advertising are typically much lower but the cost per click of this type of advertising is much lower, typically 10% lower. So where you might spend 20 to 30 cents on a display network banner, you'd probably spend two to three dollars on a search network ad when someone actually types in the keyword in a Google search. A lot of large companies use this type of advertising just to create brand awareness and they have huge budgets to advertise. So it's, it's usually recommended for those types of companies who are trying to create brand awareness on a large scale. But if you're a smaller business and trying to find new customers or clients, this type of advertising usually isn't going to produce a lot of volume for you and probably not as many conversions when compared to the search network where people will be actively searching for what you offer. If you're a small business and looking to get into pay-per-click advertising but don't have the time to manage your own account, you might be interested in being one of my 50 clients. So I will link to my pay-per-click management service below this video. Hope you found this helpful. If you did, please click the like button on YouTube. Feel free to ask any questions in the comments section below the video. I do try to answer all those. And we'll see you on the next video.